The gremlin is stirring. However, I will say that I'm pretty stoked because for an extra 28 minutes, no, you're not coming up here. You stink right now, you need a bath. We got an extra 28 minutes because she went down a little late last night because we went to my friend's birthday. No. So that was pretty amazing. I was planning on getting up at six so that I would have some time to do some skincare and some animal chores before she got up. But honestly, I am absolutely exhausted because I woke up at 4 a.m. and could not go back to sleep. So, so much for that plan. We will roll with the punches, um, but let's get today started. Mama needs some water. Um, that's all you can think about right now. I'm, I'm not even awake yet, so. <laughs> oh, let's go get Harlow out of bed. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. Okay. Oh, my little baby. Baba. 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 I'm gonna get some breakfast for the baby ready. I have a basket in the fridge where I kind of just, um, me and Laura just put together things that we're gonna feed her. And I don't know why we have two oatmeals, but <laughs> it's probably my bad. Um, we put the date on everything. And this is her little basket. So we know that everything in here is for her. All right, now after breakfast, finally doing a little skincare. Welcome to my hideous bathroom. <laughs> this bathroom is going to be next on the list to demo. Um, I'm gonna do a bit of skincare. Like I said a little earlier, I've been trying to like do skincare in the morning and at night. I'm really big on my skincare, but lately in the morning, I don't even brush my teeth in the morning. I just go pick Harlow up and like start my day. So I'm trying to change that. I'm trying to brush my teeth, do my skincare. So we're gonna do it now while my daughter is engrossed in super silly songs. So let's get started. Multitasking. Normally I would take a shower first, but today um, we're gonna be going on a walk in a minute. So I'm not gonna shower until later because I'm gonna get all sweaty. I'm trying to get those, that move ring, you know, where I need it to be. I'm getting used to sitting down and doing this. <laughs> like a vanity light situation here because in the new bathroom, I have a seating area because I don't know about you, but I am way more inclined to do a long, good skincare routine with my decollete and my chest and my hands and all the stuff if I can sit, especially while I'm pregnant. Um, I wanna thank City Beauty for sponsoring today's video. I first used their product when I was on my solo weekend with Nick in Santa Barbara and I woke up the next morning and I was like, 
My skin is so soft. It literally felt like I just exfoliated and had a facial. My skin was so like plump, hydrated, and just felt great. And now that I'm well into my 30s, skincare I'm focusing on more than ever. And I just don't want to miss my AM skincare routine. So here I am trying to make that into a habit. But um, first I'm going to be using the Uplift Firming Serum. This is what I use in Santa Barbara as well as the multi-action sculpting cream um and today they're actually offering uh 30 off their entire website so completely site-wide and you can just use the code kristen leanne to take advantage of that you're gonna get free shipping in the u.s on orders over 50 dollars, which is super easy to do um and there's also a 60-day money-back guarantee so if you buy this and your skin isn't looking and feeling how you want it to which it will but um you can get your money back so you don't have to worry about that but this is really good for just like hydrating and preventing wrinkles it helps address like sagging skin i'm kind of being proactive here you know like those jowls that older ladies tend to get here this helps tighten and firm and smooth and my skin feels so smooth so yeah i've been only using this exclusively just to make sure I'm in love with it and I'm in love with it. So I wanted to share it with you guys. I'm super stoked they wanted a partner. You know what I've also been trying to do is doing my skincare to my hands and my chest and neck as well. This is the, um, I just started using this, so I can't speak to this uh, more long term yet, but if it's as good as these other products that I've used, which I'm going to guess it is because same good quality ingredients, uh, it's going to be awesome. This is the um, Invisa Crepe Body Cream. If you read the reviews on their website, first of all, the reviews are amazing on this, but I'm using it on my belly to keep it nice and moisturized and prevent stretch marks and things like that during my pregnancy, so... On. I usually do my boobs too, but I'll, um, I'll save you guys from having to see that. <laughs> Next, now that this is kind of dry, I'm going to be using the Multi-Action Sculpting Cream. So these products really plump in, smooth in. Um, they have marine-derived ingredients. Um, you can check the reviews for yourself on the website. I mean, they're pretty amazing, actually. So I just got this when I did my live the other day. <clears throat> I just got this jason Wu serum so this helps your eyebrows grow and your lashes whoa if you don't throw it on the ground so i'm gonna be trying this out because i just wanna i wanna see your your girl needs some more lashes what do you guys think <laughs> it's a little insane so this little side i'm assuming goes on my lash line So I'll report back on that. I am also going to put some sunscreen on right now because I think we're going to go on a walk in a little bit. Well, if nothing else, it helps your brow like hair like stay up. I don't know. It looks good. Oh, oh, oh. No standing up. Let's stay sitting down. Star-shaped water. Ah. Y'all have any um, good bath toys that your kids love? Because she needs some more. All she has is these stacking cups and some dinosaurs. We're we're running low in the in the bath toy department. So if you guys have any that you really like, let me know, please. Um, Harlow would appreciate it. I got this really cute sniffle mat, sniffle mat, snuffle mat, for Piper, and I got it. I just opened it. Look how tiny this is. And look at the photo. How misleading is that? Look at this Great Dane next to this thing. Oh my gosh, I think she's actually terrified of it too. Right, I got some treats for you, girl. Okay, I'm gonna put them in here, see how it goes. How cute are you guys sharing an Italian meal? Is that a hit for babies too? You like that? I have something else for you. Saved a bunch of this stuff from PR packages. I thought it might be fun for her to sit in there. We'll see. Oh. Look at all this. 
she's like, why am I in a box? I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys where we're at with Harlow's room. We've got a lot of temporary stuff in here. Nick kept putting stuff in here. I was like, dude, I'm gonna have to take all this out because I wanna show decorating the whole thing, but I'll give you a sneak peek of how the mural turned out. I filmed it all, so it will be up, but this closet over here needs to get finished before I can do any of that. I'm not sure of the placement of everything, but the mural turned out really good. I love it. Nick picked out this carpet and this chair, and like I said, a bit of a mess, mess right now and temporary stuff going on. But yeah, it turned out really good. Next step is getting this closet dialed in. Now, as promised, I'm gonna show you guys our bathroom in its current state and kind of tell you like what's happening next. Let's go. Oh my gosh, it smells like tar in here still. Alrighty. So, we have some bathroom framing or shower framing done. This has been completely open to the outside. I'm surprised there's no critters in here, to be honest. <laughs> our windows went up the other day. I haven't shown that yet and this got hot mopped. Um, that's where they put a bunch of tar, I believe it's tar, down, and that kind of waterproofs your shower and then your tile goes on top of that. So I believe next will be the walls in here and all of the tile. They're supposed to be starting the tile on Monday and Tuesday, so that's literally tomorrow. Um, so yeah, pretty rad. And then this is kind of the rest of the demo right here. We just met with our custom cabinet guy last week and he is already making our vanity here and my L-shaped over here. And remember that a little area I told you guys about for my skincare? That's gonna be going right here. So I'll have a seat to slide on in and I will have a mirror on the wall here. And a little something we added in, he's gonna wrap this entire beam in this whole area with wood that matches our vanity, which I think will look really cool. Oh boy, I need to put some lipstick on. Um, <laughs> we just got to the fire station, so we're gonna say hi to Nick, and I decided to abort going to Once Upon a Child, like abort the mission, because after last night, um, last night I went to my friend's party, and I braved it by myself, and the whole area that they had was on the second story, so there's two sets of stairs down. All Harlow wanted to do was walk around and crawl and practice these stairs, but she's never been down a staircase before. She's too small. And, so, and there's just tons of people and kids running everywhere, and like it was just not the environment to be watching a one-year-old that just learned how to walk by yourself let alone uh, being six months pregnant. So um, I'd like imagine that. I'll, pu I'll, put, I'll put something on the screen here of a, a, like a little preview of how it was. And then on top of that, I What you doing? So yeah, I'm not signing up for that today, so I'm bummed because I was gonna see about buying her a birthday present there because her birthday's tomorrow, but I think it'll just have to be late and she won't know any better. Um, Nick did get something for her from us, so that'll have to do, but yeah, we're gonna pop in, say hi to dad, and then I guess I put this makeup on just to see Nick and we're gonna go home. Might go to the grocery store and get a couple snacks too. We'll see, I've been eating not great. We are back. Let's do a quick little grocery haul. Got some goldfish, had a coupon, Nick loves those. Roasted plantain chips. These are some of my favorite things to snack on. I got some fruit, there's the raspberries, and these like strawberries look really good actually. I haven't seen a pack of strawberries this big in a while. I'm gonna make Harlo some um, applesauce out of beet, strawberries, and apples. So that's why I got such a giant thing of those. I got some uncooked flour tortillas to try on the skillet. I don't know, thought it'd be good. I got some turkey bacon. I eat that pretty much every single day. I got some block cheddar. It tastes better than the pre-crumbled stuff. Everyone knows that, and if you don't, now you do. White corn tortillas. I tried the Walmart True Value or whatever that brand is, tortillas, and they are disgusting. So splurge and get the mission tortillas, okay? Got some Chobani yogurt. I had a coupon for that too. If you guys don't have the Vons app and clip your deals before you get there, you should get on that. Okay, this bagger, like if I was paying for bags, I would've been pissed. She put like 
one item in an entire bag and then she just put my heavy bananas on top of my greens and they're like all ruined in here. <laughs> Some people just weren't meant to be baggers, you know what I'm saying? Um, these are dandelion greens for the animals. We got some bananas. I wanna make some muffins. I've been putting out my oatmeal that I've been like craving every single day. Some avocados. My neighbor has some up that I always buy, but I only have a 20, so I had to buy them from the store. Apples for that applesauce cilantro so I can make some salsa, garlic for my salsa, jalapenos for my salsa, and a red onion because I pretty much eat this almost daily in eggs, salad, something, always have to have onions on hand. And, oh. I don't know if this is a new flavor of Synergy, but I got this lemon berry one to try. It's actually really quite good. So I'm pretty, um, pretty jazzed on the flavor of that. Tonight is part two of the 90 Day Fiance Tell All. <laughs> I usually don't get very excited for tell alls, but I haven't had anything to watch for the past few days. So I'm excited. <laughs> Today was a good day. I feel like I got not a ton done, but my skin has been taken care of. We got to hang out with Nick at the station for like three freaking hours. I guess we're good luck terms. He didn't get a call that entire time. And it was a good day. So what I'm gonna do the rest of this evening is, unfortunately, <laughs> I have to edit a video right now and I'm very tired, but I'm gonna edit a video and then I'm going to watch the tell all and um, see what that's all about. Look like it was packed full of drama, don't they always? But thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed today's video. And I also uploaded a pregnancy bump date um, video last, like on Monday. So check that out if you're curious. I know a lot of you guys had questions when I was on my live. So yeah, hopefully I can answer all of your questions there. There's like, <laughs> <laughs> make way juice all over my hands now. Um, yeah, and I will see you in the next video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I hope you guys have an amazing day, and we'll see you later. Bye.